All right, problem 230 was also asked for summation, so I'm going to go ahead and solve that. So here's your sum, 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus dot, 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 all the way to plus 101. All right, if you look at this pattern, you'll notice that the sequence is linear. It's increasing by 2 each time, and our initial value, our y-intercept, is 1. So how would we write this pattern out? Well, we would say... Um, 2k, which is your slope, plus 1. So in other words, we can think of this as mx plus b. There's your y-intercept. There's your slope. So when we set this up in summation notation, we have 2k plus 1, and then we have left to find upper and lower limit. Okay. Well, to find these values, um, we can think of all of this in terms of y, um, so go back to what we did last week. This is your zeroth term, first, second, plus dot, 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 all the way to your last term. So we're going to start at our zeroth term. So we can think of this as our x and this is our y. Okay, and we know that our x or our k will start at zero, and then we got to figure out where we're going to end. Well. If we know that our y is 101, we can take that and plug it in here. So we get 101 equals 2k plus 1. Subtract 1 from each side. 100 equals 2k. Divide by 2. Divide by 2. k equals 50. There it is. And that would be our final summation. We can go ahead and plug it in our calculator, which you'll learn how to do this week.